Hey guys, so it's here bringing you another video. Now before the video begins, I just thought I'd give a shout out to my partner, Quarterback. You guys, by the way, have been killing it the last couple of weeks with the Huz Nation. So here's the club. There's over 1,200 of you here now. So if you haven't joined, do that right now. You can earn yourself some free prizes and it's just a bunch of fun. Uh, so the thing that they wanted me to kind of say this week is we've been doing so well that we've been climbing the divisions, but they've actually offered us a pretty big challenge. They want us to try and become a Division 1 club this week. You can see over there the prizes that you guys can get. So if you earn a 1,000 trophies this week, you can get yourself 10,000 bonus coins, all the way up to a bonus of 40,000 coins, depending how many trophies you personally get. But also, the MVP, that is always a little bit close at the end of the week, uh, you'll earn a bonus 10,000 coins. So again, this is all completely for free. All you're going to do is sign up in the description, download the quarterback client that comes with it, and just do challenges. So before you play League, click play, set yourself up a challenge. You can do it in normal games, ranked games. You can do ARAMs. That's fine. And just do all that. Earn yourself some points for the club. And at the end of the week, it'll just determine how well we're doing. Right now, a brand new season has just started. Uh, and again, these coins that we're earning as a group together, you can spend them in the shop. So you can buy raffles for certain things, or you can actually buy skins. Again, it works by the person buy, you say you, you buy just a car eight trucks. They'll add you on a support account on quarterback. They'll wait 24 hours so it unlocks a friend gifting in League of Legends. And they will gift you Aatrox because you bought it on the quarterback client. That's how it works. So again, all completely for free. Hopefully you guys get involved. Again, let's get to Division 1. We've been climbing every single week. And, you know, when we get to Division 1, we'll be against some of the big boys like Red Mercy and stuff. So let's uh, let's try and beat some of those, right? So yeah, you, be, you guys have been really enjoying it. I'm really happy with how this has gone so far. Uh, I probably need to try and get my custom uh, a lion in there probably. But yeah. Join the Huz Nation now, link down below, completely for free, and um, thanks for supporting it, because I think it's really fun. Uh, but yeah, like the video already, just as a reminder, and enjoy the vein gameplay. Hey guys, so this here bringing you another video. Welcome back to Climb to Master, and unfortunately I actually have to change the rating. Uh, we got demoted, so again, I'm not letting myself get down about it. The season's just around the corner, and the game quality is just really bad. Um... You know, it's not bad for me, it's bad for everybody. So, it, you know, there's no point me freaking out about it. Because other people are in the same boat. Uh, right, so we're going to play Vayne. Because Vayne just got a buff, and I'm interested in playing Vayne. Um, a lot of people are going to go, whoa, how's on Vayne? Yeah, like, I've, pl I've dabbled with stuff like this for a while. Um, you know, I have played for a When you've played as long as I have in League, you've dabbled basically with everything. Uh, and that's why I, sometimes I've got very strong opinions about champions is because I've played for so long. Uh, it my, my opinions have been formed over many years. So, yeah. Bum, ba, da, da, da. Again, there's between Soul Stealer and po Project. I know Soul Stealer is a gemstone skin, but I actually prefer how Project looks. So, let's just go Project, you know. Let's do it, baby. Again, blind picking Vayne is a bit questionable because, again, they could just pick Ka uh, Caitlyn and I would struggle. But they banned Draven and Lucian, arguably two of the AD carries that, like, beat Vayne the most because, obviously, her lane... If, if they can just smash her in lane phase, sometimes Vayne can't catch up. Varus, okay, okay. Like, Varus, I'd say, probably has a bit stronger lane phase because he's got the poke pressure. But, honestly, not that's not as bad as I was, like, expecting. That's fine. I can deal with that, I think. Watch me absolutely feed like crazy, but we'll, we'll do our best. We'll do our best. Um, we're with a bard, and he's got bard as his clan tag, so hopefully he'll be good. Again, we are against a Zyra who does decent damage, but I don't know. We, we can deal with it. We can deal with it. We're going to go with max kill challenge on uh, quarterback for obvious reasons. <laughs> for, you know, we're playing vain. Get kills, buddy. Bard is kind of bad for Vayne. Really? I wouldn't think so. Because his damage isn't bad. He's got healing that Vayne needs. And he's got survivability. That if you time it well with the Vayne, you could actually make her survive to get her Q back on cooldown. Obviously, her... her um, her um She just got buffed. That's why there's been a rise in Vayne. That her uh, Q stealth while she's ulting has been halved in the cooldown. Which is a really good buff. Um, but yeah, let's get into it though. We're playing Vayne in the bot lane. And we're hoping it'll go well. All right, welcome to the loading screen. So as you can see, it's like a ooh, diamond game just everywhere. 
So it does say I'm still Diamond 3. No, we did get demoted. So I'm in Diamond 3. But the enemy team's got a Diamond 2. So I presume there's a duo queue happening. The win rate on the Varus is really bad. But let's just have a quick look if the Zyra's duo with anybody. So she is duo with that guy. So again, that's why I check it sometimes. Just it's worth knowing. So their bot lane is likely to have more communication and kind of be on point together a little bit more than me and this bard. Because, you know, we're solo. We, we don't know what each other wants to do. Uh, that's a pretty bad win rate with that amount of games. Remember, the more games played and the negative win rate is a bad sign. Again, same here and same here. So three negative win rates on my team. Enemy team, only two games. So again, a low amount of games apart from this guy. So good win rate on Kennen and he's against an Orn. I think that Orn, honestly, is going to struggle a lot versus Kennen. Uh, Orn, it's weird. He's been kind of buffed and kind of nerfed. So he's been buffed if he can survive the lane phase. But the likelihood of him surviving the lane phase has gone down because the shield of his W is gone. That was a big thing for Orn, and he now doesn't have it. So we'll see. But anyway, let's get into it. We're playing Vayne in the bot lane. All right, welcome to the game. Today we're playing Vayne. We're using the Project skin again. Some people said, why didn't you Soul Stealer? Again, I just prefer Project. It looks cooler. Oh, that's so cool. All right, hopefully uh, the PC holds together and I don't get weird mouse problems. That would be great. Uh, Zargol, thanks so much, man. Oh, snap. I don't think I've ever seen that dance. It comes with its own music. I legit have never seen a vein do that with Project. Why did I go Doran's shield? Because I need to survive the lane phase. It's pretty much that simple. Wait. Do we want to do that? I think we should wait here. Because if they come, we might be able to just do... I don't think we'll get first blood, but we could get like a flash or something. Jesus. They had it. Wait. They either had that warded or I have no idea. That was a... Like, it looked like they were just running in it and then they turned the second that they had to. That looked really weird. But okay. It must have been warded. Remember, you can get extra gold when you play against a Zyra. Doesn't count to your farm score, but it, yeah, I knew that was going to happen. And Rise, geez. So again, both of our solo and A-list win rates are really bad, remember? So again, I'm not expecting this game to go well. They both solo lost their lanes already. I don't know how it happens in mid lane, though, by the way, because Orianna has heal and flash. So it's not like she did an ignite play. So that's very odd to see. Oh, come on. I could have got one of those. Okay, then Rise kills the Ori. Well, I'm so confused what's going on. And then Rise is dead again. What's going on? Orn seems really bad since his rework. Yeah, I haven't seen an Orn win lane. Um, but wait, wait, why? Like, look at this Rise. What he just said. Does the guy? Did the guy not see that we just got a double kill in bot lane? Like, what? Should have gone for max assists. Yeah, I know, right? I've gone for max kill challenge because I'm playing Vayne and then we get two assists. Woohoo. Nice. She just came back to lane and got absolutely wrecked. Sweet.
Okay, got the Ignite. And heal. So they didn't use either of those when they just died. When Lee Sin came. Remember, they're duo Q, so they'll be on communication. Maybe Rice thinks Ori's ball is a nugget. <laughs> Maybe. There's probably Vision. What max do I want to do? Hmm. The thing with Vayne, you can do Q, which is, I say, her standard max. But you also can do W max. I think W max is better if you're snowballing. And again, I'm not an AD carry main, so let's just go standard. Balls. That rises health. Woo! Body could just get us a double kill her. Yeah, come to me for guys. Thanks. For duo Q, these guys don't seem great. Again, their communication seems pretty poor. The thing is, the Varus actually, I think, misplayed that, by the way. Like, notice how he was like, right, I'm just going to fully commit to Vayne. One, he was never going to kill me. But two, who would you rather the kill to go to? I'd definitely prefer the kill to go to Lee than a, a Vayne. But he just ran into me and, like, gave it to me for the, from the tower. It's like, probably the wrong person, man. Probably should have, like, ran. He probably should have run towards Lee Sin and hoped Bard or Lee killed him. Why give it to a Vayne? Don't know. Yeah, I'm going to go Bork into Rageblade. Uh, is it called Rageblade? What's it called? Is it Ginsu? I can't remember. It's called both. <laughs> it's both of those things. Again, it's an item that I never build because none of my champions build it, obviously. God, I, when was the last time I played Vayne? Again, I love AD carry as a role. It's just really depressing when you're stuck with somebody that is like, you know, incredibly questionable. It just feels really bad. But this, this bard seems quite good, so I'm happy about him so far. Also, the mouse actually feels better. It has, hey, nice. At least he got one. Uh, the mouse hasn't acted up once so far this game. Touch wood. Again, I, what I just did in between um, the games was I just... Res on my MSI Afterburner for my graphics card, I just reset. I just went, go to defaults. And maybe that did something. I don't know. Oh, that was so... If he, if he got the Varus. Ow. Ow. I don't know why I do that touch wood thing because I'm one of the least like superstitious people that I know. L a lot of my family are very superstitious, by the way. I'm not. Like my grandmother is very superstitious. Like if when she sees a magpie every morning, she always does the good morning, Mr. Magpie and all that. And my dad's quite superstitious too. My dad literally will not walk under a ladder. He won't. Uh, if he can help it, he won't stand on a crack, kinda. Like, within reason. Yeah, this bard's good. Again, he is a bard main, so you'd expect him to play quite good. I want him level 6, though. Literally, he is on the ball with exactly what I want him to do. How cool is that? I was like, I want him level 6, go for that instant play, and maybe we can make something happen. Really cool. It's it's really nice 
when uh, you have someone I, I ping the wrong thing when you have somebody that like you know you're kind of on the same vibe even though you're in solo queue that feels awesome the unfortunate thing is the rest of my team is not doing great if they just hold on and don't feed I think we'll be okay but it's not going well Orn didn't press R in time. Well, we'll see if I can carry, but again, I'm playing AD carry. I'm going to try and actually make this start pushing towards our territory. Because I'm actually allowing him to free farm. And he's actually ahead. Leeson has been waiting in there for a long time, by the way. Ugh, I misplayed that a bit. He doesn't have ult, that cane, I'm pretty sure. Oh, really good stun. Oh, that was a bad Q. Nice. Yeah, it worked out. Worked out fine. The problem is, right... Oh god, he's going for it. Not bad. Yeah, I can get the Bork upgrade for free. But he has to be near me to do that. You don't just randomly get it. You've got to be within 600 range or something. At le when he's level 14. And that's if he gives me the first upgrade. Which I think he should. Because, you know, Bane. Well, I accidentally dodged that. By just not even dodging. The best type of dodge <laughs> is not dodging at all. Wait, did he dive? What is going on with this Orn? He's already 1 and 3, and now we witness him dead again, 1 and 4. And he was 1 and 3, and he was here. Again, you got to question people sometimes, man. Like, what are you doing? Ah, that was a bad. Oh, that's so much plant damage. And ignite. I should have flashed earlier, maybe. But I was a bit... I got the kill, I'm pretty sure, right? So, that yeah, I got the kill. This bard is 007, by the way. That's good. But yeah, just too much damage. That's baiting. I... Don't do it, dude. She's baiting 100%. No, she, he, wow, the Zyra wasn't baiting, it's clay, unless Kane, yeah, he wasn't down there, no way. Wow. Wait, he, nah, he's level 14 and he can right click you for a free upgrade. Yeah, but I thought in the patch notes it said you had to be in certain range. That would be a little bit overpowered if you can do it from anywhere on the map. I doubt that's a thing. And I'm pretty sure I remember... It said within like 900 or something range. You know what skin that I really want Bard to get? A parody of Aladdin. Like the genie from Aladdin? Wait. That's pretty good though. But you know, like the, you know, I know, uh, I know, like he, it wasn't that character, but you know that I can show you the world. I think that would be really funny. 
I've been pinging for ages. Uh oh. Okay, there he is. Kill him! Kill the beast. Oh, that bard is so good! This bard makes me happy. He legit is really good. I can shoot. Oh, that's a yikes. Oh. To be fair, we've all done it. They're minions, though. Cannon! Okay. We're doing fine. Oh. Not even close, baby. <laughs> that was close. I should have actually got in Bard's ultimate, but I, I, th I thought about it too late. I should play Eddie Gary more. <laughs> I'm having fun, man. It is well fun. But again, I, I find AD carry fun when it's going well. I hate AD carry when it goes bad. Like, it really feels bad. Yikes. Why flash? I know he was probably, like, having the, the small chance that the, the tower would stop attacking him, but it was so small chance. Wait, Gosu got banned? Really? God, that is actually a name that I haven't thought of in a while. What did he get banned for? God, if he, I will say, without the mouse issue, which I've had for the past few games, it feels so much easier to play. Obviously. Because I actually can control my mouse. Third party programs. Wait, really? Well, I scripting. No. He claims it would be untrue. It's probably untrue, man. Like, Gosu, I think, hasn't he gone to, like, events and shown that his mechanics are insane? I'm pretty sure. Like, if you're a, if your job is content and you're risking that by using third-party software and stuff like that, you're, you're not going to, right? Like, there's, there's, oh, there's, there's no point to risk it. So I really doubt he did. He's just going to go all in. Why, hello there. It is our, uh, uh, uh. Uh. I even ulted for that and it didn't do anything. Bard is beating up a cane. <laughs> what is going on? My can. Oh, no. Team! Ah! Hey, let's go, dude. Again, I'm going for max kills on the quarterback challenger. We've got six, so that's not bad, man. Give me... Oh, I thought he was going to say, give me your nuggets. That would be funnier. A nugget stealer in mid lane. I 
I like this bard, by the way. He's a good boy. Like, he really... Like, the, the Varus is out farming me because all this Varus has done this whole game is farm. And I'm bad at farming. So, that's not surprising. Oh, wait. Didn't I hear the Gosu thing? That there was, like, a controversy that, like, he, he got... He went to Riot Support. They said, you're not being banned for anything. And then they realized he was a streamer. And then he got unbanned. And then people were, like, moaning about it. Nice. I think I heard about that, actually. It was on the Reddit. Why are they fighting the Rise? Like, again, this Varus's win rate was bad, wasn't it? So... I know I don't play AD carry, but at least I know the strength of my champions. Wow. GG. They might surrender. Hey, what a good game though, huh? Who would have thought it? Hoz on Vayne. We had a good game. I will say mainly carried by this bard, but we had a good game. Wow. God, Orna's pulled back top lane a lot, man. Give me the upgrade, Orn. Get level 14 and give me that upgrade. Yeah, I know, I'm waiting for him to get level 14. Then I'm going to just run to him and like put my nose in his mouth and be like, yo, upgrade me! Ooh, the cool cooldown is really low. Oh my god, it's like less than a second. But he's still not level 14. Get level 14, you bum, before the game ends. I want to see how it works. He's still not level 14. Uh-oh. Can we back off? I don't like this. We're going to get aced. Can we just back? Oh, God. Oh, that's bad for me. Yeah, see, this is what I meant. I wanted to back off ages ago. Uh-oh. That missed. Okay, I'm actually surprised he missed me then. <laughs> yeah, Bard. Well, it wasn't Bard's first death. It was his second, but yeah. Just overstay. He's still not 14! <laughs> Please! <laughs> Worth just having a look. Alright, what build do I go? Phantom Dancer, okay. Gimme, gimme, gimme the upgrade, please. Wait, did he say it was going for Rise? Wait. Who are you giving the first one? If he says Rise, I'm gonna slap him. Oh. Ornolt! 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 Why didn't he Ornolt? To rise? Screw this guy! That's not nice. I wanted to upgrade. A whole new world! I'm dead. <laughs> Kennen just obliterated me. I think he flashed into me, right? Oh my god, I went pop! He's level 14! Oh, Lee, I feel for you there, bud. Oh, what are we doing? I don't know! Oh god, we just got aced! Look at this. We're just, well, I think we're just doing, we're a bit too messy. 
We're just playing a little bit too nuts. I need your death crown. Yeah, but no. Uh, but uh, 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 give me that. Your team has destroyed a turret. Nine people died. I did. Yeah. Look at the deaths though. Kane is trying to hold it. <sighs> we should probably just do Baron. Whoa. Oh, look, the mouse problems have come a little bit. Oh, dear. I feel a little, a little bit of jamming. I'd say the Rise has recovered really well this game. Oh, he got the upgrade. Come on. Could just do Baron, you know. Better than what? I heard a ward. Oh my god, Zyra almost wrecked me. They've got so much, like, chunk AoE stuff, man. Like, as Vayne, that I've got very short range. Oh god, what are we doing? We are mucking up this really badly. I think we've just lost our concentration. Holy moly. They have three massive AoE ults. If I get hit by one, I'm dead. It's pretty much that simple. Um. Hmm. I'm gonna go do dragon because I may as well. Vein strength isn't really team fighting. Yeah, th that place where we fought was, like, ideal for the enemy team. Because it's a really, like, sh small enclosed area. Kennel ultimate, Zyra ultimate, Orianna ultimate, Varus ultimate, Z um, th thingy Kane knock up with W. It's perfect for that area. We need really open spaces. That's what we need. Where I don't get, like, trapped in somewhere. Wait, what? Straight to death. I think we're gonna lose. Because we just keep throwing all the time. I shouldn't have taken that rise teleport. Uh, Solar Warrior 10, thanks so much, man. Okay, I'm just going to mute the Lee, because again, the, the, the Lee's flaming me when he started that by dying by himself. Like, come on, dude. I know I'm not playing great, but don't ignore your own problems. Go, Gio. Uh, DK39, thanks so much, man. Right, the enemy team's got Baron now. Are they just going to barrel mid? Ooh. 
Again, the, the big difference in this game so far is just the team fight difference. They have their all their team is built for team fighting. We were doing really well when we were getting picks and stuff. We we haven't won a team fight, I don't think. It was always just getting a pick and then we outnumbered them. Orn is 15. Oh my god, give me the upgrade. Again, I gotta be really careful about my positioning. There we go. I don't go in the middle. I don't die. Hey, again, if we don't, if we get picks, we win. Kane, for some reason, I don't think was involved in that team fight at all. Because we got picks, I didn't get touched. And if you notice what I did differently that team fight is I waited. I actually waited a long time before I began fighting. If you re if you rewind it, I waited for uh, Oriana ultimate and Kennen ultimate, then I went in. So again, you could risk like throwing because I wasn't doing damage for a large portion of that team fight, but at least I didn't die. So I guess that's what I need. I needed to do differently is I just needed to be a lot more patient. There we go. Kane was, yeah, was Kane bot lane? I thought he was. So that was really bad by the Kane. Kane was carrying his team like crazy, but then in the same instance, he bot lane and then his team get caught and he dies. So yeah, that was good. Uh, I'm giving it to the Bard. That Bard played really well. All right, we went 10, 5, 9. Uh, we got plus 18. So we went away from getting back into promo, which, you know, cool. Uh, again, I'm not an AD carry player, so my farming wasn't amazing. I don't think Orn managed to get another upgrade on someone, by the way, because he got his own. I think he did Rise's death cap, yeah, there. And then he didn't do anyone else's. So that was unfortunate. Uh, I just, I, he didn't have time because by the time he was level 15, he came in and he engaged with his ultimate. So it was a good engage. But yeah, that's going to be it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Again, my quarterback challenge. Uh, we're in third place. So, I, I, well, I think I actually came in third place. Everybody else's challenges are in. So third's not bad. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. That was vain. Normally I don't play it, but it was fun. Uh, like, subscribe. See you guys next time.